And Python is quite good with his Athena. And we're also gonna. Ha I think if Python gets a lead with his Athena, it's gonna be quite difficult for Nick, uh, Nyx to chase. While and while of course Nyx has Invis, the Athena can outspeed her a bit. So starting on uh, Nyx here. Got Fortnite Gamer, aka Donna. And uh, neither major items taken yet. <laughs> sort of posturing around each other, and that's a big movement error from Donna. Gonna cost him a railgun. Do the orca dump. Ooh, that one. <laughs> okay, no, it's tight. Yeah, he planned that. He didn't need too much height. <laughs> he has that double jump. And he's just setting a trap. Oh, nice. Great rock. Oh, the second does not connect. He uses yeah. uh, invis to escape. Maybe, maybe a bit premature with that invis there, but um, he is safe. And I think it's going to be interesting because uh, Python's going to be able to deny a lot of vials with as he's Athena, so uh, we might see a bit of competition over those. Yeah. I yeah. think uh, Donna just wasn't expecting that hook to go so high. <laughs> but th we do see the game plan, right? He, he does not now, really yeah, want to me. engage. He wants to set the trap. And um, both items up. And we're going to keep see that the items just sort of staying on their same timing. But um, Python has all three hooks while... Donna's got uh, 15 seconds before his invis. And again, being as silent as he can be. We, yeah, because like if Nyx get caught by a, by a rail from the distance, Athena has the hooks to uh, close the gap. And you can pretty much just say your prayers. Um, so I like how uh, he's uh, engaging this uh, map. Yeah, Donna has a stack advantage right now, and that is a big rail. But um, question is, he going to be able to push the Athena? Yeah, it's interesting that he's choosing to take control instead of chasing the frag up. He's too early, he eats a rail because of it. Has a few seconds to do something about his mega health. Ooh, I think. S yeah, Python was aware of it, but now he doubles back, and that is not the move to make. Donna with the first frag and getting the mega health after it. So he's, he's really slowing Python down. Not giving him a hint. Like if you don't move, your movements can't be predicted. And I think my stack alone. Donna should win this, but no. Wow, the wow. last second uh, his LG stopped working or something. I've been able to get frag. And uh, bit of control here. <laughs> That damage is big though, and um, we're gonna see if Python can defend this heavy. Yeah, just after Donna died, he uh, changed his tactic a bit, a bit uh, plus forward again. But it seems that he now, now back to the defensive mode. So he actually appearing too early on this oh. one, and before it spawns. Two rails. He does fall on it. Picks <laughs> it up. He takes her out and I think Python just wants up for this kill and nice rail. Oh, and he just misses. If he had LG out, he would have gone the frag. And uh Python. He's not too stacked, but he does have all the weapons, as opposed to Donna who doesn't have rail right. So I'm tickling with the LG. The heavy is 10 seconds button. away. Yeah, I wonder uh, what the Donna is going to do. 
second. I think Python isn't sure if Don is there or not. Making a lot of noise. He's caught in the back. Wow, nice reel. Oh, but the defensive oh, damage don't... again from Python. And. Oh. Yeah. A little bit too Just... predictable. Five minute warning. Yeah. But Donna. I think Donna may have not had rockets there, and that's why I went for the LG play. But the hook sort of threw him off. Nice try vault damage. Oh, he should die here. Another frag for Python. Uh, oh, and since Donna is looking for rockets, he might lose out on Mega here. Both players heading towards it. Good hook from Python. Oh, he actually hit him. It's a midi. Great midi from uh, Donna. But, um, he's so low. And we should... Oh, the invis comes out. Oh, no! Oh, what a prediction rocket. Nice. Impressive. That was beautiful. And, um, Python's keeping this game fast, and... I think the Knicks is just struggling a bit to keep up. We've seen the Invis save uh, Donna a few times, but just a lot of times he's caught out without, caught without it. Yeah, Python also setting up early for those uh, major items. Just defending uh, the pathway to it. Yeah, Don is of course searching for at least one light shard before any fight. The good rail, but I mean he's got Mega behind him, so it's not gonna mean that much. Although that second one might. But uh such a big gap between the items. Python's got plenty of time to come back. Oh, and that missed rail is big, as Python's just able to push in. Although both players low. Nice. Great decision and to well just uh, use rocket launcher in that instance and not uh, yeah. do it. And great to rail. just stay up there. Um, he read that Python 40 drop. Oh, great wow. rail from Python. Both players low. He gets it. Yeah, Donna. Wow, he yeah, he has uh, enough time to uh, get something uh, going. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> all the time files are gone then. And uh, heavy for Donna. And Python doesn't really have any stack right now, or the railgun, which will cause some problems. <laughs> He's gone very aggressive on this armor. Great rockets! Wow, he just jumped yeah. over the ones Python was uh, shooting at him. And we got a really close game. Like, Python is not able to evade the fights uh, when he, uh, yeah, he, he has nothing to work with. Yeah, Python's aggression was really good when he was in control, but I think out of control, you just need to back off and slow down a little bit. Uh. So but it, yeah, it, it will still be hard for uh, a Nyx, uh, right? If Python now just changes his game plan. But no, he... That was a great weapon switch from Donna, switching the MG up, uh, instead of the rail there. And great frag, and it's 5 all. Team Python's still playing aggressive. He really wanted that rail. He's going to look for damage on this heavy as well. It, it, he, he wants to go for it, right? No, uh, thankfully he doubles back. Mega helps next, and we have a race to win. Oh no! Oh, nice, yeah. The Avis <laughs> mitigates the portal or the jump pad. Oh and no, the rocket! Great damage to both players, both on 1 HP. Oh, Python manages to win that by skin of his teeth. Uh, he's not out of the boots yet, right? Yeah, hit. Donna just plus four. Oh, and he actually doesn't didn't lose that much health. Yeah, he gets a heavy as well, which means that's really gone um Donna's way, as he's in a better position for this mega. He has missed a couple rails. 
Oh. And I mean, those rounds would have meant so much um, with only 20 seconds left in the game. And Python able to get on Railgun. Oh, if he can release uh, a rocket or a rail. Oh, and that invis is forced. But oh, Python just jumps in and hooks out. No, no defensive uh, rockets hit. Well, yeah. Donna actually. We have no invis. He's gonna pick up this mega, but he takes a rail. Both players are available. Oh, no. both missing. Such a sweaty match. Yeah. I mean, both players were willing to risk the match on hitting that rail. Oh, is he gonna peek? Oh, but yeah, I think I could just hook, right? Yeah. Wow, this was dangerous. Like, if Python was hooking and Donna missed that shot. And he... I, we're in a bit of trouble. Look, Donna's just shot his last rail. And suddenly that rail fight looks a lot worse. And there's no rail ammo anywhere on this map. He's got to actually commit to getting it. And that's not a good position for Donna with um, Python on the heavy control. Yeah, for him, he uh, has to take the long road. Can't catch me now. Or do the rail while Athena can just hook it. But this is a nice yeah. uh, defensive stance. Oh, and is he getting... Uh -huh. Ooh, it's only 20 damage. Yeah. Oh, nice rocket from Python, though. And Donna, he, he really needs this rail. But he's in the open here. Python's able to hit one. Oh, he two. hits two, and he's just got to leave. And, I mean, it's been uh, over a minute, and he still hasn't been able to get that rail ammo. No, no, and also uh, oh. a little bit... Uh, oh, he can collect... Uh, yeah, and now. he's given up uh, the mega to take the rail, and that's honestly not a bad decision. Although he has used his invis to get it, so Donna really doesn't want to be caught out before the next rotation of items. Oh, Luckily, he doesn't get detected, <laughs> <laughs> and he gets open. If he can hit the second one, like yeah, now he probably doesn't know that uh, the mega half is a little bit delayed, and again he's just uh, early. Oh. But this time around he's hitting like a truck. Yeah, and Kyvan just is forced to leave here. I'm not so sure about this invis. Like, yeah, it really well, wasn't yeah. necessary. <laughs> if he could, could have trapped Python that way, yeah. Also Python just uh, just stopped moving. We've not got much time till this mega. Donna in position again. But um he does have to find catch piping out one point and a great defensive rocket. Oh we actually have an aggressive move from Python. Yeah. Decides uh, to not drop down. Like yeah, everyone is just waiting for the opening damage. That is go time. Oh, this time the opening demons come yeah. from Python, but there is an escape route. Wow, and oh, he hits it. Right around. Oh. And I mean, like they're, Python just <laughs> they're keeping each other at bay, right there. Yeah. As soon as one hits, the other returns the damage. Both these players, they don't want risk. They want a definitive frag that they can uh, get. They don't want to risk getting hit by a couple rails in a row. And we're just going to see a slow type water rail from Python. And Dolan's just forced to back off completely. Yeah, I think the shotgun uh, r uh, light is up. And the one at the pillars. Oh, behind you. Oh, he's forced to use invis. Four minutes over time. He's uh, lost both items. He has no invis up. This is the moment Python's been waiting for. He just needs to find him now and secure the frag. And he's great damage, but Python gets the frag. And well played. <laughs> yeah, he just couldn't back off quick enough to uh, go around the corner. So easy real shot for Python. To see yeah. Here. I mean, Python knew that was his opportunity and he was able to uh, hit the shots and secure it.
So well played to Python. That was a, almost a 15 minute match. <laughs> So uh, that was uh, Donna's map pick, and we're following with Python who's picked Bruins. And I mean, these are quite similar maps in how they play, definitely the biggest in the pool. But we've got some very different champs. Yeah, Donna on the Ranger and Python on Galena. He sort of got a reverse with uh, Donna on the more aggressive champ with Python on the... Less what? Less so. Just uh, waiting for Donna to be ready. Get going. All right, both players ready. First map going to Python in a very close overtime. Uh, Donna's gonna be really wanting to win this map. Yeah, it would be awesome. Then we get too deep in race. Yeah, Bruins of Sarnath will be a uh, hurdle. Yeah. Number one thing for Donner on this map is going to be making sure that the triple stack doesn't go up. He's got to go look for those totems and uh, make sure he kills all of them. <laughs> yeah, and as long as um, Donna has heavy control, Then, yeah, you see nowadays also in the KPL that even if the oversight is working for Galena, Round begins in if you still get three, the heavy, you two, can do a lot. One, yeah. No. So, yeah, he gets uh, the heavy right from the start. Biden, oh, right actually. Off. Oh. <laughs> <That's>... What a <laughs> damage, but he still dies there. <laughs> but it was also awkward, like Donna just <laughs> moving in his face. And yeah, then it gets a little bit easier to dodge the rockets. I mean, Donna has a weapon advantage, but doesn't matter if he's done these shots, but two rails, he's gonna secure Mega. Oh, but Python gets the heavy. Yeah, and um. Yeah, Donna should probably have gotten rockets as she's out of LG, but hitting that rail is very good. Yeah, I guess this light. Might enable to get the rail and the lightning gun. Donna still hasn't gotten that rocket launcher. Stop watch. And um He's just gonna look for some damage on heavy. We do see a fake out from Python. Yeah, Donna now on 100 armor. They should hear Python and he's sort of taking himself off that mega. <laughs> Great, LG. Yeah. I was not ready for it. Then look at this. He's back in uh, heavy control. Ooh, but and yeah, we wow. weapons are just uh, <laughs> items are just too close together right now for anyone to take full control. True. And uh, that suits Donner a bit with his small, but albeit still a lead. <laughs> I'm surprised Python did not release a real shot. He was on the stairs, right? Both. Donner yeah. was. Uh, the other part sure. and that's a bit of a movement error but he is gonna be able to get this maker and that's a big rail oh but donna just was he turned it just a bit too fast and wasn't able to pick up that mega and he can't attack heavy yeah and i think now there are three totem shop so yeah life is great for a uh, python and donna might not even know python's got the stack advantage it, Python just wants to push in here. He gets the frag. But oh, one health left. <laughs> what yeah, the one health. <laughs> I mean, uh, I think 
Kyphon wants to go for his triple stack. He's able to get a bit of overstack, but if he's going to pick up Mega here, it doesn't matter. Although he actually loses out on it. Another frag for Donna. Fight. Oh, and he's just missing those rails off spawn. He's able to hit one, but uh, he's still outstacked by Python at the moment. And again, he does not have a rocket launcher. Not much LG in the chamber. So if he yeah. falls down, he only has the real yeah. to work with and an orb. To... And uh, Python, able to get that triple stack up again, has the heavy as well. And oh, it's a great rail. I think Donna might not know just how stacked Python is. Oh, but he's still working with the lead, right? So... Yeah, as soon as he get brought out, so he actually sent Python through the doorway. So he has an escape route. Oh, does not have an LG to punish this uh, jump pad, but wow. <laughs> an orb and two rockets. But a lot of MG coming out of Python just there. Are not able to kill a totem? It's first one he's killed in a while, but oh wow, great trap and Python able to get the frag. And uh, another heavy. And we're gonna see triple overstack totems once again. Yeah, of course. Uh, if he gets his mega elf, it will yeah. be up again. So we'll have a pocket mega just in his, uh, ready for him to use. And yeah, another frag on Donna. Yeah, it starts a clean one. Oh, still overstacked on the uh, health. He got some of the totems and now they have it to do it. So, Donna, only one frag in the lead right now. And the That's momentum a big is rail. definitely in Python's favor. Oh, that is a huge rail there. And as long as Python's quick to this mega, he's got plenty of time to come back to this heavy. But he's actually just searching for the frag. And, um, Fiend's made a bit of a mistake here about mega timing. May have switched the items up. And this could be what Loki needs to get back into the map a bit. May the power heal you. Yeah, he does have two totems up and uh, collecting those uh, time piles. Yeah, I do think like he's just prioritizing uh, the heavy right now. Yeah. But, well, he's about to have a to another to triple totem up, so... Not the worst strategy. <laughs> oh, it's real. I mean, Python has a totem he can go back to. Wow, did, did he just drop down? Or where did... There's two rails from up top. <laughs> he must have just had a really tight angle. Nice. And it's uh, not looking great for Python anymore. Oh, but it's Donna who do is, does need to do some cleanup. I think he earned a place uh, on the there at the uh, heavy. Uh, oh, great entrance by Python, actually. Wow. I don't know how Python won that. <laughs> well, <yes>. just <laughs> planting all the rockets he needs and uh... he was 10 HP and he somehow just didn't take any more damage. That was some nice dodging indeed. Yeah. Using the happy as mate. Gotta be a bit careful here, Python. He won't have his triple stack for a while now. And, um, he's out of rockets. Be healed. And I think that totem down at Heavy has been there the entire game. And, I mean, it's just like Donna should have probably checked. Great rail. Uh, Donna with big overstack now. Oh, uh, looks like he, uh, he, uh, he's checked the totems, but she might actually just die here. Oh, but great LG from Donna. 
Yeah, the pushback uh, from his LG made that fight him give up. Plant his rocket. Ooh, is he going to get? No, he jumps over the rocket. But thankfully, Donna switches to the LG, and the mega health start to wait. Oh. And Python just aggressive off one of take. We're gonna see one of the most aggressive uh, fights of the game so far. And I mean, ah, oh, and missing that rail is huge. As uh, Python's able to get heavy, able to pick up the rail. Yeah. He's got more weaponry as well. So, so what should Donna now do? Just uh, plus back 90 seconds, or still appear at the items? Uh, he need. I think he needs to get a hundred hundred before he um get gets on gets on yeah, the Yeah, especially items. because he's out of control, yeah. right? But like plus going full plus back now is definitely a bit risky. Um, Python just got so much stack. Don has got to be scared here. One minute warning. There's 10 uh, seconds. Yeah, I to really to hope Mega. Dona does not have to reel out. Like, with such a rocket jump that you miss your reel, you're pretty much and dead. He has the orb, and he gets the frag. Wow, and not even going through it, but the orb itself <laughs> seems to deal. Yeah, I was not expecting that, but Python with the oh, refrag. No, no, you can spawn for us, right? Go, go, yeah. go. Dona needs <laughs> to get the F out. Ooh. <laughs> he was making Only 30 seconds left. Python seen him there. This is... Oh, surely there's a frag to Python. Yeah. And the lead tied. We've got heavy up as well. I mean, this is looking good for Python. Donna is able to get that mega though. Yeah, Python should have gone, or uh, Donna should have gone to the portal and just uh, play his tricks over there. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, and oh, that rail. This is going to be a frag for Donna, right? Yes. Oh. Nice. Gets it right on 10 minute mark. GG. Uh, well played to Donna. And Python just went for a rail there that he shouldn't have. And even though um, Donna didn't have LG or rail, the rockets were enough in that position. And we'll go to a third map. Yeah, nice. We had a 15 minute first map. This one had also a little bit of overtime. Yeah, right down yeah. to the wire there. So <laughs> it's just there. Uh... Yeah, I think we all saw that a uh, tiebreaker uh, was in the works. So, yeah, this means we move into uh, deep and race. Uh, right? No, it's crop and keep. Right? Uh, no. Uh, it is deep and race. Yeah. <laughs> My brows are stretched. <laughs> okay. And um, we've got Python on Doom while Don is on Saw. <laughs> Alright. And we'll get it. Right. Nice. Both players ready. They want to get into this. I'd s sorry, yeah, I'd slightly favor the saw lag on this map, but both champs are definitely good. What do you reckon? Yeah, I uh, I, I think they're both uh, really strong. Um, but yeah, personally, I also fi favor uh, saw lag. Like it's just uh, yeah, the map is a circle, especially the upper parts that you can. Uh, Get around pretty quick with this lady. But yeah, Doom has to double jump to uh, also get into a position. And uh, Python really likes his Doom. <laughs> I believe one of his favorite chants. Round begins in. Three, I'm on a Donna. Two, one, yeah. fight. They've just get Mega off the start. As well as LG. I think he's he's gonna be scared but also want the rail right now. And uh Ivan just decides he's gonna take LG. <laughs> and really um 
No defense from Donna. And Python able to get back on this rail and... I mean, Donna's only got LG right now. He's not in a great position. How many did get the first heavy, right? So, that is a major lifeline in this LG fight. And, um... Looking for some damage Omega, but... Happy to just take this, uh, heavy. He isn't really... He's only 100-100 right now. And Python looking stacked. So good defensive damage. And, uh, Python, um, uh, Python, yeah, he did not have to reel yet, I think. Yeah, yeah and now, now he, he collected up. it. Yeah, but I mean, Donna sort of... Wow. Okay. Donna was just unaware of Mega Time. He thought he'd already taken it. Oh, and he's run past the heavy and he's knocked off. And Python in a great position now. Yeah, that is just unfortunate movement. Yeah, oh, and... <laughs> like, he's playing heavy, so Python will have an easy time connecting his shots. Yeah. Oh, good rail. I like how Python's going for the angles, going for the shots, willing to leave Mega up for a bit. Although it might cost him uh, with this heavy. Yeah, oh, but he's caught on. Yeah, I don't know how to uh, circle the long way around. Yeah. On a great rail, and he's off the map. <laughs> you hate to see it. A uh, great pressure from Python. Well, now he's uh, missing a shot. He uses the doom movement. Uh, his team. <laughs> yeah, it's great. And wow, he, he just died there. Took so much damage, I feel the rocket and spit. Yeah, it does spawn at a nice place. Gets the heavy, can collect the rail. Now the rocket launcher is on the way to the lightning gun. And I don't know. He, he does not collect all the weapons on the map, just as in the Runes of Sarna. He just wants to uh, be limited so he can be yeah. more creative. <laughs> yeah. the tools he has. Well, he does great damage. Oh, and uh, wow. Look at the oh, speed. Yeah, it would have been great. He's every rocket, <laughs> but he's hit that rail. Breathless. He's caught piping off. Born as well, and he might equalize here. Need some so much machine gun damage means he's actually forced to back off. Python uh, listening to heavy metal uh, while getting the heavy. Yeah, Don actually hitting the first uh, opening shot. But can't catch out Python going for the LG. It's a great stack here. Let's see what he's gonna do. Here's that bounce pad. Good rail. Nice. Oh, oh and Python just brought oh. he, his movement was way too predictable. Yeah. Oh, he does get the light. That's a major light. <laughs> it's it's, it's <laughs> just, just ridiculous. And I mean, Donna's not, not railable, but he's not that healthy. Yeah, good shotgun push. Nice. Is he going to get this? Oh, this hurts a lot. Heavy in Python's uh, pocket. And I think Donna should just... Like, his position is just great, right? He's just using the top position. Listen out. Listen out the damage. He's not, yeah. He knows Python wants the LG. And uh, he's just content to let Python come to him. Five minute warning. I like that rocket jump, but nice rail from uh, Donna. And uh, no. Both players seem pretty content just 
stay to their side of the map. Yeah, Donna is not aware where Python is right now. He does hear the double jump now. And the LG is awarded to Python. Wow, but the trap. Oh, in the end, the return damage is there. On oh, that missed rail is tragic, but he does get the frag. Yeah, and then he will spawn that rail. And um, two frag leaders looking good for Donna. Python hasn't really been able to get in at all for the last few minutes. Yeah, like uh, two or three minutes ago when uh, Donna lost out onto a few frags, Python was really working with some momentum and Donna also giving him the angles to do a ton of damage with the rail. But uh, I mean, he, he has adjusted great. He. Yeah. Misclick. <laughs> I think he's uh, not meant to have used ability there. <laughs> Donny pretty, pretty much has uh, the major items on lockdown right now. Also, yeah, this is just catching out. And there's some momentum going uh, Donna's way. It's going to be tough for Python to come back. But as, as I say that, he just hits a ton of shotgun damage and gets it back. Yeah, and now it can just turn around really quickly. Well, but not after that rocket. They just and the so much damage. pit connects, he's going to die, right? Oh, no, Ooh. he's got the health bubble. He's... Donna's on him though, and great rocket. I mean, Piper just on him. I think he's just sort of um, throwing shit at the wall, trying to get a frag here. Yeah, and he is the one uh, who needs to get clean frags because it's such a small map, it's hard to evade any fight, so. Donna only has to do as much damage as she can. Yeah, just basically take a stance while Python needs to get uh, clean entry damage. I if mean, he, if he not, not wants to die from a refrag. But two minutes left. He's just sort of got to go for it. Five frag, definitely possible on deep embrace, but it definitely isn't easy. And uh, any time that Donna kills here, just really useful for him. I mean, bit of damage coming out from Python, but just so much stack on Donna, he's not going to do much. Good rail, there's a possibility for a frag here. Oh, <laughs> he's just tickled him with the LG, made him railable and then killed him. Well played. Uh, I mean, it's still going to be such a struggle from here. Well, it uh, starts with hitting your rails. He's uh, hitting, but uh, yeah, Donna is just plus backing. So now with the nil in end and hitting the rail, it's uh, such a momentum stop on our fight. And 20 seconds left. There's no way he can get four frags. He just seems to want to get at least one more. <laughs> and we've seen some great rails come out. <laughs> He's still there. What? Oh. <laughs> 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 he hits the close range rail and jumps off the map and calls the GG's and well played to both players, a really tight series. The disrespect. Uh, <laughs> could have gone either way. <laughs> nice, GG.
I wouldn't expect that uh, or predicted this outcome. Uh, I think um, well, Python definitely did better last AQL. He's not in form right now, and um, Don is definitely uh, looking better. But um, we'll see if we get a revenge match at the end of the season. <laughs> Yeah, great control and positioning from Donna. That really uh, made him take uh, this map. Definitely.